I am the Chris who plays games, and this is my new car. So I just bought a 2017 Volkswagen GTI. I'm not here in my garage. I don't have a million books, uh, but I, I do have a, a neat car that I thought I would show people. So, um, so this is the 2017 Volkswagen GTI. This is the Mark 7 model GTI. I got the Sport. The Sport gives me a couple things. It gives me a little bit more horsepower. One of the things that's useful for me, given where I use it, is that it gives me a limited slip differential. Uh, this is useful because because in the snow in Boston when you are trying to move your car if you don't have a limited slip differential uh, your front wheels while they are attempting to drive will happily just spin and spin and spin uh, on one side while the other side doesn't move not really good for getting out of the snow the car is uh, is you know brand new the sport comes with the tartan cloth seats that are kind of a classic part of the GTI you know styling um, we got some cool looking dashboardy things so we got fancy looking speedometer and everything else like that with the sport you get the push button to start I'm driving a manual of course because why would I drive anything other than the manual in the sport you know so you want to start the car so you just push the button uh, and the car starts right up for you a stick shift six speed We've got all kinds of fancy, you know, uh, performance monitoring for the car, so you can see here the temperature gauges, PSI, and, and G-forces. In the console, you've got uh, a whole bunch of fancy, um, you know, display stuff as well, so you can look at your driving data, and this can be a digital display of speed. You can do travel time, distance, range, etc., all these kind of standard things, I guess, at this point. But for me, it's all new because I've never bought a car before, so this is my first car purchase, my first new car purchase as a result as well obviously Android Auto gives you integrated uh, uh, driving navigation system from the Android phone uh, other than that it kind of sucks I don't know how much I'm gonna use it but it does have you know built-in USB and aux and all these other fancy things overall I'm really happy with it fits the bill of what we we're looking for it's it's fun to drive you know I took it out I think my biggest concern with it at the moment as far as fun to driveness is that it is a little bit too hard to actually move this car fast enough to make it feel like it's challenged it really it really just likes to go so but at the same time it's okay to tool around in the city and it's not going to be uh too upset 24 mile per gallon you know city uh 34 mile per gallon highway but mostly i'm just excited that i get to have something brandy new here and really excited with you know the way it looks uh i think that you know i bought the the midnight blue color here and i i really like the way the metallic midnight blue really comes out nice i think that with the fancy you know you've got the red brakes that you can see there as well as the red stripe in the front it, it really gives it a kind of a, a neat a neat look here on the car so that's a, a look at my new um gti four-door hatchback sport model manual transmission 2017 uh volkswagen gti so that's about it bye